from the government. Hmm. But you say the people who dismissed him are like as black foxes, right? So I mean, look at this. It's, it's kind of weird, right? Right. I mean, it, it should be kind of fun to to read just because it's so weird. Yeah. Right. Is it going to make its way to the office? That's Lord. Uh, I know. I can see his word. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, really, it can't so, so yeah, no, can I yeah. just, I have yeah, yeah, sure, a sure. questions, yes. you can put okay. somewhere here. Yes. Okay. So the first question, yeah. what do and you in a few minutes we have to meet to do our thing, yeah. Okay, yeah. so what, what do you think about future of complex optimization, like, I took your class E364A, yeah. Yeah. and uh, uh, yeah. half of the class E is 364B, so what do you think we should, about the future? Again. Yeah. Uh, oh. But I think actually I'd, I'd, I'd love to have it as, as uh, organized as the people who do the deep learning stuff have, right? I mean, okay. I, have, I, mean I have huge respect for them, right? Because they, you can say all sorts of things about it, yeah. but the point is any of us can go, you know, pip install whatever it is and yeah. we'll be doing deep machine learning whenever you think of that. Yeah. You'll be doing it in 20 minutes and it's not, I mean, it's a lie, of course, if you look closer, it's much harder to use than it's supposed to be. But the idea that, I mean, they made, they made good implementations available to the whole world, good for them. So I would say, what would you say we are? I'd say we're two-thirds of the way there. Okay. Would it be odd? Would you say that? Maybe, maybe more. Yeah, more, what would you yeah. say? Maybe we're more, right? But I want to be able to do it for, like, uh, image, pro I want to do MRIs, mm -hmm. uh, image processing, anything, and just have it work on lots of different platforms and... Multi-core, actually, I mean, and be a lot more reliable. Generate code. Mm -hmm. No, I think that would be that. That would be good. So just okay. to build out a, a super strong open source ecosystem. Okay, be, I think great. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what What is uh, the most your disappointment about complex optimization? Do you have some disappointment? Maybe what do you don't like? Because a lot, as you said, there are some problems which are, for example, not convex. We yeah. did some tricks in E three sixty four A to try to reduce to convex, but uh, uh, there are no such, um, for example, secret recipe. How if problem is not convex, how reduce to it to convex? Find this nonlinear. Well, transition. most don't. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm actually let's see. Do I have a disappointment? I don't really have any. No, I don't have any disappointments. Okay. Any. Yeah. Yeah. I, get, like I, get, I mean, these are like in the, that's in the category of street fighting tricks, right? You. Yeah. You. you uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> that, that's what I'd like to do. I'd like to teach a, a course called S Street Fighting Optimization. Do you know? No, I don't know if I have <laughs> infinite time. I have no, yeah, if I had time, I would do that. It'd be fun. Okay, yeah. Right. But Stephen, by the way, you read this book and the uh, book about control. Do you have plans I don't know, to write a book about E364B? Or no? Bits and pieces, right? We, wrote, we have a whole bunch of things on that, right? We have an operator splitting thing. We have a... ADMM paper, we have a long, I don't know. Yeah, bits and, so bits and pieces have been written in these 80 page things. Okay. Yeah, so we're writing a couple, we're writing one right now, actually, that's what that's gonna be. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so we have a couple of those. Okay, so maybe okay. in future it will be some book? New, uh, new, new, new. No, they, they we, we may just leave them as the way they papers. are, just bits and pieces. Yeah, but they're, they're, they're longer ones. than papers. You know, they're like 80 pages, 100 pages, something like that. Yeah, okay. we wrote one on finance. This one fun. that you showed? No, 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 we just wrote one. So everything's online. You just yeah. Find, yeah. Um, okay. Yeah. Uh, so the, the second question, uh, the following question, uh, mm -hmm. about this machine learning. So does it exist some 10 years ago, 20 years ago, 30 years, 30 years ago? Because people maybe think about it previously, mm -hmm. just uh, don't think about constraints, don't think about model, just give data and uh, please reduce some, I don't know, some system yeah. equations from it? Uh, so I, I think it's actually, I mean, things, things are happening right now really interesting, right, about how things are changing and, you know, five years ago, I guess it was, the world was kind of consistent. People used these convex methods and our friends in statistics had all their theory and then they actually worked in practice and it looked like everything made sense, the whole world made sense. Um, and now I think it's, it's being fractured or, I mean, it's very... I mean, in a good way. I mean, an interesting way, because like, I don't yeah. know what's going to happen. You know. yeah. So, this is by our, our, our friends doing deep neural nets, which I think are fantastic, but... Yeah. Yeah, too complicated. Don't make no sense. And, and, and what? Don't make no sense. And yes. You do it because it works, not because yes. you know anything about it. Or yeah. There's nothing principled about any of it. Not, yeah. It's terrible. 
<laughs> yeah, yeah, but it, so it, it would it would be it wouldn't be as interesting sociologically if it was terrible and didn't work. But what's kind of cool, well, I like it because it's terrible and it works. But it also that makes it more interesting. I don't know. I find that more interesting, right? Interesting, yeah. yeah. Okay. And uh, does it uh, some uh, take uh, Lagrange duality of this non convex function and try to solve not via subgradients or gradients method mm -hmm. in primal variables, but should we talking about the non convex ones? Yeah. Oh, I mean, they have their own methods for doing that, and I think they're good. I mean, they're fine. I, so I, don't, I don't, you know. Okay. Yeah. Also, those are really, they're not issues of algorithm. I think they're mostly issues of systems, right? Yeah. And so, like, if you look at CAFE, the whole idea is to have your, your GPU. Running at eighty yeah. percent, all your all your buses are kind of yeah. maxed out. I mean, they I saw a talk about it. it's beautiful, right? So they do. So you're fitting these things, and like uh, all the all the system resources are like at eighty percent for a GPU. By the way, that's a lot. So, <laughs> so I mean that that's but we, also so that's a because uh, they have a lot of right. but, yeah, yeah. Yeah. but that's a weenie, really. right? That would be awesome to see. Oh, I see. To, Fire up a convex optimization problem and find a, 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 a GPU or eight GPUs working together, all maxed out at eighty percent wow. capacity. Yeah. It'd be great. Yeah. Because when they, cause when a GPU is running at eighty percent, it's like watch out. Yeah. Right. Yeah. That's a yeah. lot of computation going yeah. on. Yeah. Right. A lot. Yeah. So. Yeah. Okay. Uh, mm, let me check. Uh, what do you think about stochastic programming? Like in E three sixty four A, we have only one lecture. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's about, very interesting. Right? Yeah. I mean, and you, I think uh, I have friends. Yeah, there's a Russian uh, set. No, no, yeah, yeah. Uh, they're from Russia. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but they are okay. all here for stochastic. Yeah, program, stochastic right. programming. Be sure it's, it's all from that's all so that's all from me. Moscow State in the sixties and seventies, and, and then a lot of them went to uh, Georgia Tech. This guy uh, Shapiro. Uh, no, no, no. I, I came from from, okay. uh, from just from yeah. work. I know. Okay. No. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And uh, uh, so um, he he asked me why uh, he he think that you are concentrated on classical convex optimization and uh, mm -hmm. don't have a lot of papers in stochastic. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Maybe. I don't know. I guess it's yeah. You don't like stochastic programming. No, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah. I mean, I think it's it's. Uh, I mean, a lot of the stochastic optimization stuff is actually easier than people make out the theory, yeah. right? I mean, generate 10 samples and do a worst case or something. I mean, we're, we're doing that. It's actually what we're about to talk about. So, but yeah, it's fine. Yeah. Yeah, I don't... Uh, it's interesting. You, yeah. Yeah, I remember you wrote a, a yeah. joke. You said, theoretically, you need one million samples. Yeah. <laughs> but... In practice, you need 10. 10. <laughs> 10. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. 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 So, uh, yeah. We, okay, we, we, we should do our, I think, so we should, is that? Okay, uh, I think approximately, yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> That's great. Yeah. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, sure. Yeah, if you're around, uh, if you're, you're going to be around for 40 days, you're going to yeah. be around 40 more days? Yeah. Then, yeah, I mean, look at, the solver, look at the solvers that go with CBX Pi, like yeah. SCS and ECOS. Yeah. It would be, it'd be super cool to port some of those to uh, the GPU. Now, unfortunately, all they work very heavily with, um, um, I mean, unfortunately, they work with sparse, then it's all sparse. Okay. And then and we had, we didn't get CU sparse working very well at all. Okay. I mean, it's faster than CPU, but not, not much. Yeah. I decided to make a final project in this CS mm -hmm. 229. Mm -hmm. is, uh, take some problems which are reduced to convex optimization, SVM, linear regression, linear regression, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, append some extra constraints, show how convex optimization how can be cool, mm -hmm. then do all reduction by hands mm -hmm. for some specific problems, mm -hmm. and then uh, mm -hmm. do injury point method right. in CUDA. I don't sure, I'm not okay. sure it will be, that'd be really, very great. That'd be kind of cool. You were, Nick, you're just looking at that, right? What? Into your point, things in CUDA or something? Yeah, no, for this embedded stuff. Yeah, okay. Maybe less, okay. less for CUDA, but. Okay. Oh, it's for the embedded stuff. Okay, sorry. Yeah. Oh, so that's like our targeting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, okay so I, I will say for you uh, the final pro uh, final report I will have uh, in uh, sure. mid, okay. mid of December. I will Perfect. You, yeah. Perfect. Okay. And uh, yeah. I will be glad maybe to return here. Yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. Where is it? I'll write to you all that. Yeah, good. Okay, thank you. Okay. Yeah. Okay, can I make a photo? Yeah, yeah of course. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I'm not, don't know when I will yeah. be.